In a letter to Director of National Intelligence Dan Coats, House Intelligence Committee Chairman Devin Nunes said Obama administration officials may have acted improperly in regard to the Russia collusion investigation. Nunes said the committee believed, quote, these officials may have used this information for improper purposes, including the possibility of leaking. Nunes first brought up unmasking in June when he was leading a probe on Russia. Democrats accused him of trying to protect the White House and mislead the investigation, and he was forced to step back from the probe. If you're unfamiliar with unmasking, here's a breakdown. Intelligence services are supposed to redact the names of U.S. citizens that turn up in surveillance reports on foreign entities, but officials can't ask for those names to be revealed or unmasked if they think that will help them understand the report. Unmasking a name and leaking that name to the press are two different things, of course, but Nunes said the practice still violates American civil liberties. Leaks have been a problem with the Trump White House. Reports showed that Trump campaign members weren't forthcoming about meetings with Russian officials, though it's unclear if the unmaskings in question are related. Intelligence workers can turn down unmasking requests if they feel the request isn't legitimate. One official told the Washington Post that the idea of, quote, politically motivated unmaskings is just nonsense.